family and Sherry. Thank you for joining me. Went shopping over the weekend and picked up a few items. So we'll go ahead and I'll show you those. Oh, I'd like to share those with you. As well as uh, I received some happy mail yesterday from v Virginia Beach. So um, you know who you are. So stay tuned. At the end of that, I will uh, show you my happy mail. But first, over the weekend, we decided to just take a drive to get away from everything, and so we ended up at State Line, and we did some shopping at State Line, and I stopped into the store Nautica, and, um, you know, I'm always passing this store, and I, I just always look at the mannequins. If the mannequins have something that really catches my eye, I go into the store, okay? But if I don't, and I'll just bypass it. Well, Nautica's never really had any mannequin in the window that really prompted me to go in, but they had a 70% off in the window. So I went ahead and I walked in there. And a lot of it is your nautical theme, which you know I'm going nautical. And, uh, you know, lots of red, lots of white, lots of blue together and sailboats and things like that. But there's just always something about that store that just never really caught my eye. And this is their logo right here. And, but there was just something that just never, every time I went in there, it just didn't really sit well with me. But this time I did, I, would, I purposely said to myself, I'm going to walk out with something from this store. And so I purchased a set of, or a pair of flip-flops. And as you can see, they have an anchor on the embellishment on the sandal. And I very seldom wear flip-flops but I tried these on and you know what for as flat as they are okay they are really comfortable so I was very happy that I went ahead and I decided to get these I was going between the blue and white and the red and white and just for whatever reason I like the way the blue and white looked on my foot so I went ahead and I purchased those now further down into the mall they have the US uh, PA, which is United States Polo Association, U.S. Polo S Association, and I always want to make sure that I try to find something out of there, and it's not too difficult, okay? Um, I just love everything in that store because it's all very um, tailor-made, and everything is going to be very form-fitting, and so I just like the store. I love the colors. I love how everything is just so well made and everything and it looks like a lot by a polo by Ralph Lauren but it, they're not associated with one another and so again it was another store that just had a really great uh, store-wide uh, clearance and sale going on and I couldn't pass it up and I always try to find something out of that store whenever we are at State Line and so this time the only thing is this zipper kind of gets stuck and I just have to work with it, but um, let me see if I can get it to do its thing. And uh, I don't know why. Um, even the gal in this, oh there we go, the piece of material in the back side gets in the way. So it's just a hoodie and it's very form fitting. This is a small I believe, yes it's a small. And it's just your typical red, white and blue. It has the number three on the sleeve right there. And uh, it's just a very well made uh, hoodie and it's uh, cotton and it has the polo crest on the uh, upper part there. And just very well made and I just loved it. Had to get it so it kind of matches my little sandals and everything. Went to Wilson's House of Suede and Leather. You remember those stores that used to be in the mall but now they're just in the outlet malls. And so again great sale going on inside the store and I kind of went sandal happy even though I only bought two pair of sandals but I purchased these sandals and again uh, with them being very flat I mean I would see people walking around in sandals that are this flat there's no support of any kind whatsoever and I'm like how can those be comfortable because you're not getting any support but then again I guess it's like walking barefoot right so it's comfortable to walk around in your bare feet and everything so I went ahead and I purchased these these were normally eighty dollars eighty dollars but they were on clearance for ten I couldn't pass it up so I had to at least try it so um, I did wear these on Sunday and they are actually comfortable I, I'm, I'm very shocked how comfortable they are so I just have to change my way of thinking I also purchased a few little cell phone uh, pouches, little wallet cases. Um, 
They were normally $25. They were $5. So I bought it in this really nice seafoam green color. I also bought it in this, uh, these are all leather. I bought it in uh, this croc print as well. And then I bought it in this silver metallic color. So these are Christmas gifts for my cousin. And then I also purchased a brown leather vest. Now I've been wanting a vest for so long and uh, this is a little bit thicker, meatier, I should say, than I have wanted, but for the price I couldn't pass it up. And so I bought this brown vest. And I love it. It's very nice. It fit, feels very nice. It has two pockets, on one pocket on each side there. And it does have like your, your um, oh, what do you call it, your form fitting. And it has a little zipper up here off, off to the side. So I purchased this uh, leather vest. So that's what I purchased from Wilson's, and of course there's no completed shopping unless you stop off at Brighton. And so this is my latest purchase from Brighton, and it has the anchor chain. It's the uh, anchor, uh, nautical anchor look, the nautical look. As you see the white rope right here, and then you see your anchor chain there. And it's a little small clutch purse. I love the ornamentation here of opening the bag. And it comes with its uh, duster bag. And look how fun the print is on the inside. The polka dot print on the inside. Isn't that fun? And you also have your driver's license and uh, credit card slots here. And you have a zipper pocket on the back wall there. And it has a chain handle so you can wear it on your shoulder or wear it as a clutch purse this is removable and it has the hanging ornamentation on the bag and this is canvas and so I will spray this with my sketch card but I just love this bag it is just so much fun and then I also purchased a key fob that has the anchor and your nautical rope. I bought that. I love that. This could be unisex. It doesn't look girly. It doesn't look very masculine. So uh, I showed it to my husband and he really liked it. But I told him, I said, you can carry it. You can use it. And he's like, ah, it's from Bright Nigel, but it's unisex. It doesn't say it's, you know, feminine, you know. And then I bought the uh, umbrella polka dot umbrella that matches the inside of the handbag there. So that's what I purchased and I just love how it looks. I just love that. And so that's everything for my shopping spree that we did this past weekend. And in my mail yesterday I got some happy mail and it comes from Lois Pretty of Virginia Beach, Virginia. Thank you so much Lois. It's always so much fun to get Happy Mail, isn't it, everyone? It's just always so great. And just for you to think about me and want to send me something is just amazing. So, let's see. Oh, look at how... <gasps> Gumby and Pokey. I was just at... Oh, what's the store? Cost Plus. They just relocated our Cost Plus here. And they had a Gumby and Pokey in there, and I had it in my hand, and I put it away because I decided to get something else, and I said, oh, I'll come back and get Gumby and Pokey. But look on my card. I love Gumby and Pokey. Oh, Okay, she, she wrote me a little, little love note here, so and she starts off, hello, beautiful friend. Thank you for that. I will read this later, but she did send me a little note there. Oh, look at the, how cute is this? California oranges. It's an orange slice notepad. How cute is that? It's magnetic. So she sent me that. And oh, it's a purse hanger. And it has a purse on the, as the picture. You can never have too many of these. I carry extra of these in my purse when we go out to eat. 
and a lot of sometimes at least one person that I see put their purse on the floor at a restaurant I go over and I give them one it's brand new it's still in the package and I always explain to them you know the the hundreds of thousands of germs that are on the floor in the restaurant you're putting your purse on the floor and then you're going to put that purse on your kitchen table or your kitchen countertop or whatever um, do yourself a favor keep your purse off the floor invest in a purse hanger everyone it is so worth it believe me and thank you so much Lois for thinking of me that is right up my alley I'm a handbag fanatic and I think I will switch this out from the, pur the purse hanger that I have on my purse right now and replace it with this one Thank you so much, Lois. I really appreciate that. And thank you for thinking of me. That is so sweet of you. Thank you, everyone, for taking this time out to watch my video here today. I appreciate that. Um, it's just a little bit of something that we had to get away just to kind of clear our head from all the madness of everyday life. And uh, we enjoyed the ride out to State Line. It's about a three and a half hour drive for us. But, you know, we look at it as time just for the two of us. We don't answer our cell phones unless it's, you know, a family member or something like that. But uh, that's time for us to spend time together. And we laugh and we joke and we just, you know, reminisce on the old vacations that we took and stuff like that. So I just wanted to share that with you. And um, so take time out to spend time with each other. I don't care if it's just take, doing a turnaround trip somewhere and then coming right back home because we can get so busy and so caught up in everyday life and living and everything that we forget to spend that quality time with each other. So that's just a little, little food for thought there for you, okay? Thank you again. I appreciate each and every one of you. I pray for each and every one of you. And if I call you my friend, you're family. So welcome to the family. I'll see you at the next video. And as always... I want you to be blessed. Bye-bye now.